here's a nice car to tell you about, as usual. 2012 Renault Kangoo 1600 Expression, top model in the range, automatic, air conditioning, low mileage of 18,000, and this very pretty wine red metallic. And uh, it's got the all the luxury features, nice upholstery, seat height adjustment on the driving seat, overhead shelf, flight lockers in the back for storage. You can see those. Picnic tables, so you can just have a little drink in front of you there. Now, as you might have guessed, it's converted for wheelchair access by Allied. They're the largest converter of wheelchair cars and they've done a good job. Now it's a 17,000 mile service interval so it won't have had many services and it had one at 5,014, one at 14,900 in June 18. There's the catalogue for the car, tells you all about it. There's the instructions to use the belts and straps for the wheelchair and the rest of the handbooks. They really are a lovely smooth car to drive. People love the Kangoo. In fact this model is based on the Renault Scenic so you can imagine how smooth and quiet it is. Now I've got the ramp down and you can see the lowered floor. These straps here are controlled by this switch. So I'm going to put that up and they're going to lock. We've also got a winch which is so good to have. So that's attached below the foot plates. As I say, I will spend some time with you, make sure you're thoroughly conversant. So all we do is stand behind the wheelchair, press the in button. If we want to stop, everything's held nice and safely. Nothing happens too quickly. There we are, we're in. It really is a, a one minute job once you get the hang of it. Now in this bag, we've got the rear straps and they clip on like that. Put it around the back of the wheelchair. One more there. Seat belt around the wheelchair user. Plugging in just there. Now the ramp is an al aluminium bifold, weighs about four pounds, so not too heavy. Mind your head when you pull the tailgate down, that little bit sticks out. There we are, we're off and ready to go. We've got the side windows open, we've got storage in the floor, we've got place for a drink. In the front here, this controls your electric mirrors, adjustment and folding in both sides. Such a useful feature. We've got cruise control, we've got air conditioning, we've got radio, CD. That's controlled from the steering wheel if you want it to. We've got four automatic gears. You can drive it in a manual mode but there's no reason to. We just started up for fun. There we are, smooth, quiet, ready to go. We've also got a fuel computer controlled by the end of that steering column. It says it needs a service in 14,000 miles, with average three miles an hour, 41 miles worth of fuel in it, we've averaged 11 miles to the gallon, because it's just moving around here. It be a lot 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 better than that. The steering wheel goes up and down. Oop, the horn works. There's your seat height adjustments. There's no reason not to be super comfortable. I would imagine that car was 16,000 plus 900 for the winch. So it's an absolute bargain. If you want to talk about it, give me a ring and I'll look forward to it. Look forward to your call. Bye.